ecological abnormalities and mental insanity has begun to threaten the human species as a modern day biblical play. <laughs> Presently, our society is spiraling into a mindless mob. Pharmaceutical junk. Achtung, Achtung! Feldwebel Karl Dittmar in das Ausrüstungslager 2! Feldwebel Dittmar, das Ausrüstungslager 2! Something is done. Humanity will pass the point of no return. The government has finally acknowledged this fact, and in an attempt to stop the proverbial bleeding, the government called in the services of a one of the doctors. No, 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 come on, you set a baby in the cradle, you go big ass, I'm like a rocket skin, man, I'm a little fan of man, I'm a little fan of man, Hello, my name is Dr. Kyle. I will be your guide along the psychological brainwash. I do take tremendous caution while you view this. You'll see many themes of disturbing violence. If you have a heart condition, I suggest you press stop and pop it in all the home moving. Something fun. However, if you have decided to come along with us, I will I will <laughs> I believe we've had enough of that in the United States, particularly with the present administration in Washington, D.C. To me, the office of the Vice Presidency of the United States is a great office. And I feel that the people have got to have confidence in the integrity of the men who run the office. I have a feeling, too, the best and only thing My hypothesis is that I will be able to change these monsters. I believe I can change the way society works. By the end of these experiments, I believe that these monsters will be sane, perfect citizens. <laughs> Service. The, the, the allowance for my state of California. The connection. 
when I or any other senator makes a trip to his home state to make a purely political speech that the cost of that trip should be charged to the taxpayers. Do you think when a senator makes political broadcasts or political television broadcasts, radio or television, the expense of the broadcast should be charged to the taxpayers? Well, I know what your answer is. The same answer that audiences give me whenever I discuss this particular problem. The answer is no. The taxpayer shouldn't be required to finance items which are not official business, but which are primarily political. Well, then the question arises, claims, you say, well, claims, how do you pay claims, this? And how can you do it legally? And there are several the lines have been, been drawn. Legally, and that it is done legally. In the United Whispers around. The first way is to be a rich man. I don't have to be a rich man, so I can't do that. Another way to choose is to put your wife on the pill. My opponent, my opposite member for the vice presidency of the Democratic ticket, does have his wife on the pill. And has had.